A date with the behemoth that is Kentucky is on the line, as is a trip to the Sweet 16. It's West Virginia taking on Maryland. There's Maryland's head coach, Mark Turgeon. He's watching Jared Nickens breaking ankles here. Beautiful move and hits the jumper. Plus one. He had six points on the game. We're tied at 16 apiece. Later in the first, Jake Lehman. Alley oop to Michael Tchaikovsky. Fourth slam. Later, Lehman likes the combo, finds Tchaikovsky again. He goes up and dunks it once more. That's all four of his points right there. But West Virginia led at the half. Second half, Gary Brown from downtown with the triple. He had 14 points on the game. And then it's Devin Williams with the follow slam, bringing that one home. He had 16 points on the game. West Virginia up by six later in the second half. Dez Wells spinning, working, up and under moves, and just pitches that one home. He had nine points on the game, but West Virginia still with the lead and racing down the other way. Daxter Miles Jr. finishes with the lay -in. During the play, Maryland's leading scorer, Mello Trimble, gets kneed in the head, and you can see he's down and in a bit of pain. Watch it one more time. Here sort of falls to the ground and takes the contact right there. He left the game, and Mello Trimble on the bench, rightfully so, upset at the situation. Tariq Phillip with the steal, and on the other end, Daxter Miles Jr. with the jam. West Virginia, number one in the nation, enforcing turnovers. They're up by nine at this point. Gary Brown gets the steal, goes the other way, gets the lay-in, and it's 61-53. to The Mountaineers up. Daxter Miles Jr. again with the defense, forces the turnovers, and West Virginia gets the win, 69-59.